Today we're going to be uh, doing a, what we call technically a major autohemotherapy, more less technically technically a, a multi ozone treatment. And what we're doing, you can see, we've connected an IV line. Uh, we have a little bit of heparin here so the the blood doesn't clot, and I use a very small amount. And then the blood's going to be vacuumed up with this machine, and the blood will be taken up into this machine first, which is an ultraviolet light, which will help to decrease inflammation and kill anything in his blood and boost his immune system. And then the blood's going to go all the way up to this bottle. And when the blood goes in, we go to about 200 cc's of blood, and then we pump ozone from this machine into the bottle, and we mix it together to super oxygenate the blood, and then we're going to pressurize and push the blood back into the body. Now, typically, we'll do this for people that are very sick with severe infections, um, but I do do this with athletes or young people to improve um, workouts, to improve recovery, and even energy, and focus. Drinking coffee and doing this. I did that yesterday, and I woke up in the middle of the night. Like, oh, um, you're going to be like, feel like doing three workouts. Because I've been struggling with that recently. This is um, uh, deoxygenated blood, so and it looks a little brown. And, and that, now when we oxygenate it, it, it will turn If it's going to work, it'll help for a week. Yeah, now spondylosis we of L4, infuse L5, L5, the oxygenated blood yeah, back into the patient. Yeah, retrospesis of L5 on S1, and um, you know, a lot of back pain. He actually he had, uh, he had meniscus tears. And uh, I am uh, Kyle Krupa from Athletic Tree and Recovery. I'm co-owner over there and physical therapist. Uh, I've been feeling, I would say, like fatigue, a little bit run down, uh, almost sick over the past week or so. So I talked to Dr. Goddard. Uh, he recommended that I try one of these ozone treatments. Um, so I'm here, I'm getting, what, 10 passes today on the ozone, and so far I'm on number eight, and I feel on fire, so I'm ready to go. I feel really good. So for our disease processes, usually we're doing this a minimum of once a week, and people that really want to go after it are doing it twice a week. And really we do it until you feel good enough and we see your lab results come back normal. Now, young people that are healthy and working out, athletes, um, we're going to do this and you're going to feel good. You're going to go home and work out and uh, the next day you're going to notice your energy level. And we're really going to base it off of how you feel from the day we did it and over how long you felt better for and start to realize your, your tiredness was coming back or the focus was getting a little off. And usually it's in the two to three week um, margin for people that are uh, doing heavy activity for a living or athletes and usually every couple months for people that just want to get an extra boost.